Well, Capricorns, welcome. Mm. Welcome, Capricorns. Oh my God, Capri. <laughs> what a week, what a week, what a week. What a week, Capricorns. Capricorns. <laughs> um, oh, Capricorns, congratulations. Oh, surprise. Okay, so first, what is this week? This week, Capricorns is from the 7th until the 13th. It's the second week of March. And I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Capricorns, um, congratulations. I finally got the on-demand back. So thanks um, to, you know, the people who worked. Uh, um, so finally, we have on-demand is back, Capricorns. On-demand is based on a new series. It is called the Element Series. Now, the Element Series has to do with... Uh, um, the hurt signs, the air signs, uh, the fire signs, and the water sign. Now, that series uh, tells you things that you're not getting uh, um, from, because not everyone is a member on the channel. I would love to have all of you to become a member of the channel, but not all of you are a member of the channel. I do understand that some of you don't want to have this monthly subscription so um the on demand is back and that is going to be the element um series the element series has to do with all of the element it's just for a reading so if you want to see what your partner or someone else in another reading is buy one buy one get one free but that is going to be coming up but you um so what is happening and transpiring is that the on demand is back Go check it out. That tells you about things that is happening in the background. Because as I said to a lot of people, that's why we have the weekly readings. One monthly readings do not advise you because the first half of the month is different than the second half of the month because there is the, the seasons, okay? So um, when we look at the month of March, we begin with a Pisces season, which is good. The two first week is good for you, Capricorn. But when we look at the two last week, which is the fire sign, the Aries week, it's not really positive for you guys because you are dealing with fire energies. Okay, with water energies, it's good. Fire energies is not good. So this is why I say to a lot of people, um, one, monthly readings don't help you because you find out that a lot of people will go to different, different readers to get, you know, things that is happening. Always cross watch. And what this new series, On The Mom series, is going to do is to help you Capricorns to find out secrecy behind what is happening because I use the energy of the Celtic cross and the Celtic cross always reveal. Not every time it's going to be the Celtic cross, it's going to be different um, different sort of a reading at the, the month. It depends on what my energy is, what the frequency of my guides and angel will alert you of, okay? Um, so that is it. I want to say thank you so much um, for, you know, really for all the people who reach out for the on demand to be returned. It is returned. Just um, go to my website. I'm going to try and put the link on these readings so you guys can check it out. All right, Capricorns, what a week, what a week, what a week. You begin the week with the Nine of Cups. And this Nine of Cups is that your wishes and dreams are coming true. Um, on Tuesday, you're going to be recognizing the secrecy of your friends. You're going to be turning your back from them and walking away. Um, a lot of you, you have twice the energy of the seventh of one in this week. You're dealing with friends and uh, co-workers, friends and, uh, um, you know, people who you know. And um, you have the nine of cups, your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true because they're going to be finding out um, that an Aries person networked with other people to steal from you or use you and your wishes and dreams is coming out. You're going to be successful over your friends. Then we see you're standing, um, standing your ground against a Taurus and a Gemini. And they're not going to be recognizing that a Leo was a pleasure seeking and they're going to be, uh, you're going to be standing your grounds and said, Hey, stop. I don't want to. 
um, have anything to do with you, you know, and you're going to be standing your grounds um, to a situation between a Taurus and a Gemini. Then we see money is coming back to you because they're not going to be recognizing what an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra man, a couple. These two people are couples. So it could be Librans or an Aquarian couple, but it's coming up as a Libran man and a Libran woman. They're not going to be recognizing how much money a Libran man and a Libran woman has um, gained um, uh, um, over you. And they're going to be awarding that they return and pay you back the money. Um, a lot of people, um, the Ten of Cups family situation where someone in the family isn't well, I see a whole lot of sadness for a Pisces. I don't know. Um, uh, it, it, it is like um, your family and someone in the family um, isn't well because we, we, we see you're praying, you're hoping that this person overcome whatever is going on. And I'm seeing um, that um, a Pisces isn't well. If you're connected to a Pisces, this person is well and this person is going to be um, like going to the doctor and is going to be getting a lot of information. Um, if your husband, I see sadness. I see really sadness. And I don't want to say debt because the energy of debt is not coming up. But, you know, if you have a Pisces person, a friend a co-worker or someone in the family that their father that is an Aquarian Gemini or Libran isn't well. I see that uh, it's as if uh, the Pisces person is going to be letting you know, hey, my mom, my father, my husband, my wife isn't well. Okay. And I see you're going to be praying for this person because I see that, you know, it's someone, whether it's a co-worker or a family that you're connected with or whatever, you're going to be praying. I see you doing a lot of pray for this person because this person is not well. So it could be a family member that is an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra coming up as a Libran. Um, it can be a Gemini. Okay. And um, I see like doctors and I see family gathering together, communication and uh, I see that there, you know, whatever is happening, um, I see that like this person is going to be saying, hey, can you come visit me? Or, you know, I'm not well. Is it possible you can come visit me? But I see you're rallying around a person that is not well. Okay. I don't, I see this energy and I don't want to, um, because it's, if it was debt, there would be another energy of debt. There is no energy of debt. It is just that a family member or someone that you're connected with is sick, but this person is going to feel better. Okay. Cause there is, there is sadness. And I see if you have a Pisces friend, this person is worried that their father, their mother is going to die. No. I don't see any debt there. It's, it's some people can just be very sick and people can just come down and is sick. I don't see any debt. I see a lot of rally around and I really don't want to. And you know, if, if, if there was going to be a debt, the person, but you have a Pisces friend of a Pisces uh, um, family member that is going through a whole lot of issues because the parents or the husband or the partner is sick. Okay. All right. So your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true, ladies and gentlemen. Why is because uh, Aries had collaborated with a group of people to work against you. Uh, Aries collaborated with a Capricorn and Leo and a Sagittarian and a Virgo to work against you. And people now recognize that this group of people that had collaborated um, to work against you, they have been caught for a theft, okay? So it has to do with a network of people. The network is in, consists of uh, um, a Sagittarian, a Virgo, and a Leo. Um, they work in collaboration with a Aries and a Capricorn. Um, people now recognize that they have created a huge theft. Your wishes and dream is because these people are caught. And this is something that you were hoping that these people would be caught one day. 
and they have caught these people so congratulations then we see the energy of a scorpion and i see worries and regret for a scorpion they now recognize that a scorpion have done you real injustice and i see a tower moment for a leo they caught a leo um, what Aaliyah has done and the seven of ones uh, is that you stood your grounds and now you stood your grounds against a scorpion and what a scorpion have done to you in the past and you are overcoming this I see regrets for your the scorpion and regrets for a friend because they all created a whole lot of illusion around you and created problems for you and lied and tried to ruin your reputation sadness for a scorpion ex-boss sadness because they recognize that the scorpion ex-boss have created a whole lot of damaging um, and wanted to damage your reputation so um congratulations for that that's why you are having your wishes and dreams and successfully overcome a scorpion ex-boss who collaborated with a Virgo to create a whole lot of problems for you and you're going to be released. So then when we look again at the seven of one, so, you know, 77 is that you're on the right part and the wishes and dream is going to be coming true. Keep going and keep doing what you're doing because you're on the right part. Okay. You're standing your grounds and why you're standing your grounds, you're standing your grounds against um, a Virgo businessman and an Aquarian Gemini or Libran person, whoever this Aquarian Gemini um, or Libran person is, uh, have created a whole lot of problems for you. And this is a woman. I see a woman and her partner. I see a couple, a, a Libran couple. I see a um, an Aquarian woman. They recognize that an Aquarian woman had lied and this woman have to pay you back a whole lot of money. So you stood your grounds against a Virgo woman and an Aquarian woman and a Libra woman um, because of what these people have done. And you stood your grounds and you're like, you know, don't complain on my side of the road because I don't know. Um, I didn't invite you. What are you doing on my side of the road? And this is a situation where a Libra man and a Libra woman decided um, that you were not good enough to accumulate uh, money for yourself. It's like these people uh, choose who um, is uh, will get uh, a payout and who not. And people in authority is not going to be recognizing the secrecy of these people, how they were um, like uh, choosing um, people, um, having some sort of a special favoritism. And you stood your ground against an, a, a liberal woman and her partner. OK, so you're standing your ground against this liberal woman and her partner. I see emotion, information is coming out, the temperance. And I see that a Taurus is going to be uh, working together to balance out the situation. A Taurus now recognize uh, what a Virgo man has done. And a Taurus is now recognizing that these group of people have used them to, uh, to do things that was not above water. And when we said not above water, we're talking about things that people shouldn't do because they will get themselves in problem and end up in jail. And they use, um, you um capricorns to do it and i see you're standing your ground and it's going to be giving up a lot of people and showing up a lot of people for what they have done emotions another seven of cups for um gemini's emotion a lot of emotional situation and um social media is going to be good for you capricorns if you're doing anything on social media i see by um, connecting with social media that is going to be bringing a new Capricorn, um, like a lot of uh, financial status. Okay. Then, um, we are looking at the energy of a Aquarian Gemini or Libra man. This Aquarian Gemini or Libra man is going to go to jail. Whoever this lawyer is or this eye profession, they have done something that was not above water. This Aquarian Gemini or Libra person could have access 
um, and created problems for you. A cycle is now over for a Cancer and they're now recognizing that an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person could have helped a Cancer to do something and created a lot of obstacles and problems for you. Now, whoever this Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person is, is now going to be seeing some jail time um, because this person um, thought they and their friends would have gotten away from a whole lot of uh, uh, things that they were doing and people were watching them. Someone in I authority was watching them and was recognizing what these people were doing. So truths are all going to be revealed and a lot of people are going to be very, very surprised at what was going on and they're going to be now catching a Aquarian, or Aquarian Gemini or Libra man um, at, um, in, in, in the act of a crime and that, um, give them, um, a hop ahead for this man. Then I see family issues and I, I express this family issues and to God, I'm not hoping, but there is a situation. A lot of you are going to be walking away from a doctor. A lot of you need to change your doctor. Whoever this doctor is and whatever is going on, you need to find a new doctor. This doctor is not um, the person you should be um, communicating with. It's like a lot of people is going to be recognizing that a doctor you're not trusting this person because you're going to the doctor and you're still feeling sick, okay? And uh, um, there is someone who is sick in the family and um, whoever is sick in the family, because I see some sort of a communication is going to be coming out um, to either you and your family and it has something to do because they're going to be coming down. And whoever a Pisces is, a Pisces might not be feeling well. And a Pisces need to go to the doctor. So if you are in some sort of a relationship with a Pisces and the Pisces is not well, they need to go to the doctor. This is what is coming up, okay? Um, a lot of problems is coming up with Aquarians. So Aquarians, they can be um, doctors and nurses, liberals or investigation they are civil servants, so liberals. Um, they are now. It's, 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 it's as if an hospital or something is going on around that. Um, and a lot of you might have to be going to the hospital to visit a sick relative. But there is something about family sickness and relative. Now, I am hoping that is not a debt in the family, and this is what I'm saying. I'm really hoping that there is not a debt in the family. Um, I see that you are regretting. I see that you are, you know, um, there's something going on with a family and there's someone in the family that is sick. If it's a Pisces, tell them to go to the doctor. If it's a Libran, tell them to go to the doctor. But it could be a situation that they're finding out that, um, that the, a family member or someone that you're close to their family is that they is like the doctors and nurses um like they know something else but don't want to tell the family what really is going on with a family member so let's say that you have a pisces the Pisces said hey my mother or my father my husband or my wife is well but the doctors like like the doctors know that they're going to be dying or they don't have a um, a long time, but they don't want to tell the family. And I think that this is unfair because it is a situation where they need to tell the family what is going on. And I see that a lot of you Pisces, Capricorns are going to be saying, listen, tell me the truth. What is going on? You know, this family needs to know the truth. Um, you know, why is this a, such a secret? The family needs to know the truth. So I see a lot of you Capricorns is going to be standing up for a family and said, listen, the family needs to know the truth. It is so it's as if you expect this person to die um, and, and, and is waiting for this person to die and not helping the family to give this person a better life, a better state of life. So you need to be honest to the family and tell the family um, what is really going on with the health of this person. So, you know, it is a really dishonorable play that is going on. And I see a lot of you Capricorns is going to be standing your ground at the end of the week and, you know, I, I'm really hoping for you Capricorns, um, that this person, um, father, because it's looking as 
um, a, an Aquarian or a, a Gemini, a, an Aquarian or a Gemini. So if you have an Aquarian or a Gemini in the family, it's like they're going to be passing away, but like the doctors and nurse don't want to say what is going on. And it's like they don't want to tell you. And I'm thinking, so be aware of this. Something, uh, some sadness, because it's as if you might get message that this person is going to pass away, okay? Oh, sorry, Capricorns. And you can see it here because it is a family situation. And... It is involved and connected with someone in the family. Is it your father? If your father is an Aquarian, it could be your father. Um, if your um, wife or mother or grandmother is a Libran, it could be your Libran woman. If um, this person is an Aquarian or a, or a Gemini person. But I, I see a Pisces is very saddened. Because it's as if they know or they felt as if this person is going to pass away and they're very saddened. And so I see a lot of you Capricorns are going to be regaining money because they recognize that a couple, um, an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra couple had lied. A Cancer is going to go to jail along with a Scorpion and they recognize that a Scorpion family had access data and information of your family. A lot of you are going to be walking away from a doctor, an Aquarian. Um, so this could be um, Aquarian or someone in uh, um, Aquarian or a nurse or someone because you recognize um, this person is not who I want um, to be my doctor or my physician anymore. And I see you're going to be saying, you know, to the loki. Okay, so I see worries for an Aquarian, um, an Aquarian. And if a Gemini man is sick, this person is going to get better. I don't know, ladies and gentlemen, it is a situation because in the Gemini house, so this Gemini is going to be feeling better. So in the Gemini house, I see this person is going to be feeling better. Okay, um, they are now really going to be recognizing, and it could be a situation where they find out that a Pisces created a TEF, okay? So um, it could be that if you Capricorns, because here is the energy of the Pisces coming back, and this person is a Pisces person in the family, and they could recognize that a Pisces created a TEF against you, and people in authority is going to find out. So this could that's why the Pisces is so sad. Because people in authority recognize that the Pisces could have uh, um, worked together um, with an, an, an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran and created some sort of a TEF, okay? But there is sickness in the family. I gotta go. I do love you guys. Um, but um, this week is a week of revelation. It's a week where you're going to be finding out that someone is sick in the family. It's a week that um, you're going to be finding out that a Pisces um, that you had trusted um, created a TEF and they caught this person. So I see this person as sad. Um, there is sickness. And if some of you were sick, you're going to be feeling better. A lot of your money is going to be repaid to you. They recognize what a cancer have done to you. And they're going to be ordering a cancer and a Aquarian Gemini Libra couple to return a whole lot of money to you. Namaste.